wonderful? Yes. <laughs> this is the day that the Lord has made, and let us rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to worship on the 10th Sunday after Pentecost, July 22nd, 2018. I would like to welcome you to worship today. This, it's, this is just going to be, a, I think, a, a fun day, and I'd just like to turn your attention to a couple things. First of all, your parish life announcements. In your bulletins, uh, Bruce, of course, is doing our special music today. I'd like to thank Jeff and, and Darla for being ushers today. Connie is playing, and Mike is a projectionist today. And, uh, and I'm speaking today, just a little bit, just, just a little bit. Uh, we have office hours that are listed here in the, uh, in the bulletin. Connie's going to be here on Monday the 23rd, 1230 to 330 and Wednesday the 25th from 9 to noon. So if you need to get a hold of her, that's probably the best time. Uh, next Sunday the 29th, uh, Pastor Dr. Bo will be back uh, leading worship at 9.30. And on Sunday, August 5th, there will be our communion service at, at 9.30. Are there any other announcements that I should, oh, I've got a pen right here. Any other announcements that I should make that I'm not aware of here? Okay, then let's take a look at our prayer concerns. Um, you see them listed in your bulletin. Is there anyone else that we should add on to our uh, prayer concerns? You know, if not, let me know. <clears throat> I can add it in later. Okay, God is going to be preparing us even a little more. And so um, we're going to start with our congregational gathering hymn, What a Friend. It's in the blue hymnal on number 625. And just so I don't forget, the last hymn is, is, has been changed and it's not going to be Abide With Me. It is going to be number 26, which is This Is The Day. So just a little change on the very last hymn. And when we sing that, we'll sing it twice. And we'll sing it twice. Okay. It's short. What you want to get, yeah, it's short and really good. It goes with everything else. Okay, so we're gathering hymn, What a Friend.
Today we're going to have a number of responsive readings that are coming from Psalms. And so I will lead and you will respond and just think of this as, as we're reciting music, David's music. So, praise the Lord. Sing to the Lord with thanksgiving. I will praise you, O Lord, with all my heart. I will be glad and rejoice in you.
reading is from Psalm 100. Uh, I love this psalm. It's powerful. It's joyful. It is, is just everything in just this short psalm. If you ever need a psalm that, or a go-to place, go to Psalm 100. It is just awesome. Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good, and his love endures forever. This is for all All right. Would you please pray with me the prayer of the day? <coughs> Pour out upon us, O Lord, the spirit to think and do what is right, that we, who cannot even exist without you, may have the strength to live according to your will. Through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.
Our next reading is Psalm, the 23rd Psalm, the Psalm of Hope and Comfort. And if you'd read it with me. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not be in want. He restored.